I never give my chance to self, myself a chance to win because I just, I'm so happy to just be here. Like I'm happy to sit in the, like the artist section and watch and like be a part of the show and to be nominated is insane in itself. Um, but to actually win an award, especially like new female and that group of girls, like I love all of them. We've kind of done the whole radio tour and all of it together. Um, and I'm really honored that they, that they voted for me and gave me that. Um, and it's crazy, like I, I, they told me a couple of weeks ago, but actually getting it on stage was super like real. And that's why I got super emotional. Doing Love Me and Dibs first was super cool because it got to kind of show the fun 22 year old side of me, which is obviously a, a side of me and I've loved that. Um, but you know, I started writing songs when I was 12 and it, it's kind of the core of, of who I am as an artist and I really wanted to show some more depth and some more songwriting ability. And I feel like Peter Pan, you know, it's my favorite song on my album and I feel like it kind of captures that. And um, we, we've been waiting to kind of put it out at the right time and we just felt like it was the right time. Well, I think the coolest thing about country radio right now is that you can turn it on and you can hear Chris Stapleton and then you can hear Sam Hunt and then you can hear Dolly Parton, and then me, and then Casey Musgraves, and it's a mix of, it's country in the heartbeat of every song, but there's other influences, and you can hear it, it's super obvious. And I think that it's just allowing more people to listen to country music. I go into game mode where I don't think about things, and then later tonight, I'll probably just like look at pictures and cry. Like when I got to sing with Taylor, I went into game mode and then literally I got home and I looked at the picture and I bawled my face off. Cause I'm like, that's not even me, but it was. So that's what I'll do probably.